Hi, my name is John. If you've come here for engineering, machining or welding or steam engines, you'll be disappointed because this video is all about cooking. And what I'm going to cook tonight is smoked haddock and asparagus tips in a creamy parsley sauce. No engineering, just a little bit of cooking. Uh, I've been asked by one or two other female subscribers if I'll do another cooking video and the wife's bought some smoked haddock, so I'm going to cook it because it's not here so I can, I can play in that kitchen. Anyway, that's enough talking. Let's get stuck in and see what sort of working mess we can make of it or whatever. I've got all the various components set out here. That's how we see the smoked haddock. That's the asparagus. We've got some fresh parsley, some butter and some pea and flour. The first thing I'm going to do is prepare the haddock to be cooked. I'm going to approach it in milk. So the first thing we need is a nice shallower pan to approach the haddock in. Right, the haddock goes into the pan, skin up like that. I'm just going to rinse my hand because I've been touching raw fish. Right, so the haddock goes into the pan upside down, or skin up. Put a bit of salt, some black pepper, then some whole milk, and only our diluted stuff here. Right, that goes onto a, a heat and it's slowly brought to the boil and allowed to simmer. Next I'm going to prepare the asparagus. I'll bring the camera in a little bit closer so you can see exactly how I do this. Right, this is the asparagus there, probably six inches long. You need to cut some of that woody end off. I normally make them probably four inches. So we'll need a good inch and a half off the end of each one. It appears to have them all the same length. Once you've got some cut, you can just use that as a template. Now I want to cook these in the microwave. You might frown, but until you've tried it, right through there, we're going to do a nice dish like that, evenly spread out. I could have made them a little bit short, I would. Right, in there, a little bit salt, a little bit of black pepper, a little bit of olive oil. You need to get microwave for probably four minutes, certainly no more than four and a half. We'll put that on one side. The pasta sauce is really simple. All you do is pull the little flowers off the hard stems. So that then it's what you want to eat. Not the nasty woody bits. You need to cut it up nice and finely. Length than this would do, but possibly a long stand you'd be able to have. Right, the haddock's just on the simmer now, so I'm going to prepare the, the sauce, small sauce pan. In goes the butter. Right, I'm just going to turn the fish over. Right, 
and it's just about just about cooked. It's gone nice and flaky, starting to fall a bit, so that's nearly ready. Right, the fish is now cooked, so we'll take it out, put it on a nice warmed plate. Just where the skin helps to hold it together. E whoops. Right, back to the sauce. We're going to use the milk to cook the, the fish in to make the sauce. And the sauce is sticking up quite nicely. It's time to put the chopped parsley in. Asparagus has been in for four minutes. That's nice and tender. Not the smoothest sauce in the world, but I'm sure it'll taste nice. Once again, it's just time to see it. Thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and bon appetit, bon yard. There it is. Pretty good. Absolutely spot on.